up everyone what is happening in a team so this week we have the games kind of bit that's going to be going on i think it starts tomorrow if i'm not mistaken and they have released just cause for tornado gameplay trailer today now for me personally um when just cause 3 came out i wasn't really too fond of it originally and then i actually played it and i had a lot of fun so i'm actually looking forward to this in a sense uh because i kind of know what to expect with this game and if it's the exact same or if it's a little bit different as far as you know if they've improved some stuff then i know i'll have fun with this one too so what we'll do is we'll check out this just cause for a uh, tornado gameplay trailer and we will see what we got and if it's something that really intrigues me then i'll let you guys know at the end of the video but other than that let's see what this trailer is like and uh let's see what we got let's go ahead and get this video started and let's see uh what they have in store for us Peggy 18. Shakir, the narrative director at Avalanche Studios New York, working on Just Cause 4. It definitely looks like they've improved the lighting on this for sure. In this mission, Rico's pursuing a massive tornado as it weaves a path of destruction throughout the grasslands. And this is the Storm Chaser, the only vehicle that allows it to do so. Alright. So I, I like the way this looks so far, as far as um, graphics and lighting. It's interesting. Hmm. Looks like this is like an added side mission that they have into it. Damn. Okay. I mean, the destructive environments in Just Cause 3 were, were really, really good looking. It looks like this is about the same as well, too. Yep, this looks like the same type of destructive gameplay as the last one. Oh, that's not bad. It's not bad at all. Okay. I love the grappling aspect in uh, Just Cause 3. Came in handy in a lot of different situations. Wow, what the hell? That's all we're show today. It's just a small glimpse of what to expect in Just Cause Okay. So then, my question with that is, see if they're going to show anything else. I don't think they're going to show anything else. I think that's it. All right. So um, my question with that mission is, if those air cannons were used to keep the tornado at bay, then what was the point of destroying them and i'm pretty sure we'll get more answers to that when we actually play the game in december but um other than that though i mean the the graphics look like they definitely improved a little the destructive environments look to be about the same if not it's probably improved some as well too and um as i said just now i love the grappling mechanic and just cause three uh because it actually helped out with a lot of different situations 
and when it came to traversing the areas as well too. So um, I'm looking forward to playing this. I'm, I'm looking forward to actually getting my hands on this. Um, I don't think I'll be pre-ordering it, but I'll definitely, um, I'm not as close-minded with this one as I was in part three. Um, so with that being said, that's just called 14 year the gameplay trailer. That was released today. And as I said, uh, GamesCon is coming up, so uh, we'll see what we have. So leave your comments down below. Let me know how you guys feel about this. And if you played Just Cause 3, uh, did you like it? And if you're looking forward to playing Just Cause 4. And for all of you that are new, if you enjoyed this video and you'd like to be a part of the A-Team, make sure you hit that symbol on the right side of the screen. And if you missed my live stream from yesterday, that will be on the screen for you to check out as well, too. And until the next video, guys, I'll holler at you later. Peace.